three for OCRA is the most unpredictable of the papers, but I've been doing some past paper analysis to come up with some suggestions of what might be more likely to come up for OCR paper three 2025. Hey everyone, and welcome back to Miss Estrick Biology. And in this video, I'm going through what might come up in OCR paper three. However, big disclaimer, whenever I do these videos is this is just based on past paper analysis. I don't have any insider knowledge. I can't see into the future. So this doesn't mean they are predictions and they're definitely coming up. So I don't want any hate in June. If this isn't what's on the paper, I'm simply sharing what might be more likely based on past paper analysis. So make sure you don't just revise these topics. Okay, let's jump straight into this. I'm going to keep this short and sweet because I know you're busy with your revision. So first of all, three commonly assessed topics on paper three are biodiversity, communicable diseases, manipulating genomes. These three are commonly assessed on paper three. And although paper three can assess anything from the OCR A level, these three are the most commonly assessed topics that have come up historically on paper three. Now, what I would recommend is maybe re-watch this video after you have sat paper one and paper two and consider, did those topics already come up? Because if they did, maybe they're less likely to come up on paper three because instead they've been assessed on one of the earlier papers already. However, if they don't come up on paper one or paper two, then that would mean it's potentially even more likely that those three are going to be on paper three for 2025. Next then is considering which topics haven't been assessed recently on paper three, but are quite frequently assessed on paper three. And those are populations and sustainability, inheritance, nucleotides and nucleic acids. Now, if you have seen my paper one and paper two video already, these topics also came up on those because across the board, inheritance, nucleotides and nucleic acids haven't been assessed recently. So who knows which paper it might be on, but it's pretty likely that those two are going to come up either on paper two or paper three. And then don't forget the key skills in general for paper three that you should definitely know. Experimental techniques and practical techniques are key. Data analysis and evaluation and applying your knowledge to new contexts. So those application questions. So that is it. Short and sweet for you, paper three, what might come up? And if you do need help going through these really challenging topics, then check out my new OCR A-level notes, which now, yes, include all the theory, key marking points, but also examiner's tips, end of topic summaries, and end of topic retrieval questions written by an actual OCR examiner. So definitely check those out in the link below. But that's it for this week. I'll see you soon.